Hello there everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to some more CK2 Game of Thrones in our Corsair campaign. Where we are currently trying to get rid of these fools down here. I did not mean I... Like, this guy's apparently my best friend now? <laughs> what? That's... yeah, that's a thing. So anyways, uh, we have... we do have a little raiding party going out now. Right here. 2,000 troops. Uh, crap! I... I had a feeling I'd forgotten one of them, and I certainly did. Oh well, that's fine. You do have some troops here. You do have a hundred, hundred guys there. It's probably um, unsullied, so I don't actually want to deal with that. I don't want to take a naval landing for unsullied. Here, you know what? We'll uh, quickly send you guys here, and then bring you back. Prince Doran of Dorne. Looks like his independence war didn't work out so well. Lord Harion of Carhold. Catelyn, is that Cat? Oh, that is Cat. She was married to the Karstarks. <laughs> That's kind of funny. From a Stark to a Karstark. Come on. Dang, autosave. Ja, that of pneumonia. Okay. Well, your other siblings are alive, and one of them will be... Would be a uh, thing. A king sometime. And probably an emperor. Help Ego, the unworthy. Drogo is just cleaning up. Holy balls. But, I mean, it's what Drogo does. It's what I did when I was Drogo. It's super easy. Drogo is just like overpowered and badass. Those military stats and all the troops that he gets, it's very easy for him to expand. Okay, so we have uh, our 2,000 troops all ready to go. I really don't want to jump on these Unsullied because they're going to kick my ass. But actually, you know what? They're not even my troops, so I don't care. Let's just go for it. Let's see what happens. I believe the king is in that army. They're still gonna they're, gonna... they're gonna do some damage to us, but we're we're flanking them and everything, so... We should be fine. Like, they're killing equal numbers, which is really hilarious. Considering that we have overwhelming odds, they're killing equal numbers. But anyways, now we are here, and we are sieging. Or, not sieging, we're, we can't siege these damn things. Like, 20,000 defenders. But we are gonna take all their monies. All their 40 ducats. And then maybe we'll move on New Guess as well. So we got more patrol posts being done. Excellent. How's this thing doing? It's recovering. And Spymaster, I think you are ready to be moved now. So we'll move you over here. And this plot should be... Yeah, it has a really good chance of firing. That's good. We'll work our way through these guys. Kick them out one at a time if we need to. Alright. And I'm actually curious. It might be worth just moving... Uh, oh, hey, now. We have some troops there now. It might be worth moving these two guys. The um, quartermaster and the first mate. Because I don't think they're really helping out that much more right now. So I'm going to move them over here. We'll see how many. Because we're going to lose a whole bunch of these. It's like 1,400 probably that we're going to have. Oh, nice. Diligent. Diligent for air. Thank you. Yeah, so that's that's fine. It's only another like 200 troops. I'd rather have them help out in these other places that are much lower. And uh, yeah, Arkamoon. Diligent. Thank you. That's good. Master Chibundo died. Well, at least we got his money. And I feel like these guys, should they not have heirs? They're not getting married or anything, so you know what? Like, I'm not... Um, okay, this guy got married, so he's smart. <clears throat> I'm still his heir, though. Oh, because he's got a, uh, a daughter. That's kind of funny. Well, once he dies, then I'll have another... Uh, bunch of money. 
Another 100 ducats at least. Anyways, uh, Gerada is needs an educator, so... Sure, wifey, you can educate her. Actually, that's a good idea. I can keep wifey happy. You, uh, you still want some more money? Yeah, I'll give you some more money. I know you'd like that money. Now, I want more kids, too. Just, you know, I would like a strong son. If she does pop out a strong son, then I will definitely have... Have a, uh... A change of mind about my air. Also, I can't help but notice that you're an adult now. I kind of want to, uh, you know, since you're not technically my child, might as well. And Paymaster, we will, I wish we had somebody better than an 11. Let's hire somebody, see if we get somebody good. We need a man good with coin. Arkamoon. Hey, Arkamoon. You are named after my son. Are you... Nope, you're not worth it. Okay, well, I guess it'll be this guy. You're not very good, but... Better than nothing. And everybody else is doing stuff. Yes, yes, they are. Still sieging over here. We're still pillaging. Yeah, they don't have enough troops to move on us, so we'll be able to take their 40 ducats. Here, wifey. Don't kill me, please. Okay. 42 ducats. Very nice. Hmm, I'm thinking about the money. Uh, oh, I should probably give this away, too. The, um, the money thing. What am I going to use my money on? What would be the best? I think just more castle towns is a really good idea right now. Could use a patrol post here though, so we'll do that. But yeah, more more castle towns is probably what I'm, I'm gonna focus on for a little bit. Just because making that money is gonna be super important. Yes, we're gonna make a ton of money off of raids, but I would also make like to make a ton of money off of just income. Well, looks like he does have some troops over here. I don't want to jump on that. Let's go up to Astapor then. Okay. Aw, can't sleep with you. Why not? I'm at home. You're in my court. Is it because you're not technically an adult yet? But you should be. Oh, whatever. Catelyn. Oh, cat. So cats are gone. Cats are gone. Which means that we lost another person on our list here. Still have Brendan on there, but I think he's the only Tully that I care about right now. Alright, well... And that's uh, Cat and Net gone. Edmure. Oh, I still have Edmure on here too, don't I? Yeah, there he is at the bottom. Alright, well, anyways. Astapor, you have. Oh, God damn it, everybody's got Unsullied. Anything here? Nope, that's a ruin. Anything here? I don't see any troops there. It's good. Illyria. Hello, Mr. Illyrian. I'm here for your 29 ducats. Cool, cool. I love getting that live reinforcement rates. Very handy. These guys have some massive forts up here, though. It'll be tough taking these out. Oh, is this, uh... Oh, no, these are all ruins. Okay. How is this damn plot coming along? It still hasn't done anything. Come on, plot. Please, I would like to kick the guy out. Were we doing anything else right now? I can never remember. I always lose track of what I'm doing. I know we are raiding. Lord Paramaster reached war for... For the Iron Throne. Oh, okay. Well, that'll be interesting. Hmm. More money. Nah, it's just... Nah. How are we doing here? Almost there. Oh no, we're ill. Oh, that's not good. Uh, we're still... Like, we're still 
fine age-wise. We shouldn't die from being ill, but if we die now, we're in trouble because he is not old enough to take over. And I'm pretty sure the game's just over. It won't be over, but it'll be it'll be really tough for us to come back. All right, do I just? Uh, let's, I guess we might as well keep keep on keeping on up here. Okay, good, and we're not ill anymore. That was a nice. Uh, Wow, okay, Mace. That sucks. And Willis is blind. Snap, son, what happened to you? Do we have uh, Marjorie on there? Yep, we got Marjorie on there. And she's betrothed to a bastard? Oh, I guess it is a Martell bastard, but... Um, are you still... No, now you got a weak claim. That's funny. Funny, funny. So you have uh, oh, 85 troops there, that's not too bad. Army, the Plaza of Purification, what is even... That's a city name, that is a cool city name. Alright, well I think we can jump on this guy though, it should be fine. One of the local nobles might be corrupt. Yes, use it as you see fit. We should not engage that, I don't think. And I have with me the fine. What fine? Oh. <laughs> Damn. That is a big fine. Is this the guy I'm trying to... Yeah, Odin... Odin whatever his name is. Does that not give me a reason to revoke his title? No, I guess that's only with the, uh, the way of life thing. It's the focus. <clears throat> okay. Oh, I, yep, probably should have looked at that. And this is part of Marine, so if we go in there, these troops are going to engage us right away. So I'm not going to do that. What about this? Is this, um, this is a thing? Oh, that's a city. Oh, hello. How many troops do you have? That's a fair bit. But we might, no, we're not going to be able to have enough to uh, actually burn this place down, are we? We do have enough. And our guy is a siege leader, so he might be quick enough to actually burn it down. Which would be amazing. Because the city will give us so much loot. And I'm just curious. Did I start my phone? A timer? I sure did. Alright, good. Because I tend to forget. Okay, um... I guess we can't really do anything else right now. I just I want either the damn claim to come through on that one island or those plots to fire or something exciting to happen because right now we're just we're just being boring old pirates. Looks like he's not responding. Or not yet. We have some plots. Rescue Dazar from Wow, everybody wants to rescue Dazar. Who in the hell is Dazar? Okay. Do we have a righteous imprisonment on... Oh, it's on this guy. Lord Odin Zanga. So we do have a... Uh, he wants to buy his loyalty. Are you one of mine? No. Who's this guy? Okay, so we have an imprisonment reason. Which is perfect. Because if he declares on us, then whatever, it's fine. I hope he... Um, I hope he actually fails. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Because if he doesn't fail, then we can imprison him, but we don't have a reason to revoke his title. This way, we can. And he's, like, not going to have anything. He's got, he's got seven dudes. So we can just raise up this little army and just go and take over. Ah, 50 troops. You know what? Numbers do help in this. And we will... We don't have any other siege leaders, right? I didn't get lucky? No. One can always dream. Alright, so those guys can go there. I guess we don't need you here anymore. Can I work on this guy next? Well, that plot shouldn't... Shouldn't be a thing anymore. I'm just gonna cancel it. 
I can't incite him to revolt. Why? Why? Why is it only some people I can incite? I should really look into that. I'm, I'm really curious why that's the case. We could just pick up some tyranny, but I don't really think that's worth picking up tyranny just for this crap. Hmm. Uh, let's take a look up here and make sure we're not getting jumped on. Oh, still good. Yeah, can we pass any more laws? One. Oh, right, right, right. Because it's not the uh, the newest version of the game. You can't pass laws multiple times. You're ugly and your mother smells. Is what I just said to him. I don't think he liked it very much. Hmm. Caldrogo migrating all over the place. Yeah, see, I don't... I don't know why why is it that only this guy could do that too well whatever i guess we might as well just have you go home and scheme for now and uh lady la lady please this is another way i guess we could take over those lands is by actually fabricating claims but oh god they, they're so slow as it is Alright, let's uh, finish this. Yeah, we'll attack the enemy, that's fine. We will kick their asses. Or not. I guess because we attacked them with the, uh, the weak army first. <laughs> you idiots. <laughs> you fought seven guys and you lost. Was it seven? Maybe it was more than seven. Maybe I'm just crazy. Uh, well, we only got actually 20 ducats out of that. I really... I thought it would have been more. Let's see if we can stick around here for... Nope. March 15th, February 5th. Oh, we're more than good. We have attacked the enemy. We already beat them. Message. You showed up after the attack happened. Alrighty. So, I guess you guys are shattering. Send you back, and oh, you do have a decent amount of troops there, so we'll just siege them out. Okay, boats, you have 100 ducats on you, not too shabby. Where to next? Any one of these cities? Ooh, I know where there's cities. Let's go out here. Can you not go through here? I guess you can't, like, cut directly through. I'm curious. I'm just... I'm gonna go through here just to see if anything happens. I doubt it. But, you know, I've been watching Game of Thrones, and in the show things happen, so... Maybe some special events will happen when I go through here. Or maybe not. Probably not, but maybe. Nope, doesn't look like it. Alrighty. Do you have any troops defending your crappy little city? No, you don't, sir. Time for me to go say hello. Volantis probably has like 20, 30,000 troops or something. Yep, so I gotta watch out. But as long as I just take over these little islands here and there. Should be enough. <clears throat> and this city is fairly rich. 14 ducats. Was that who had a daughter? Somebody had a daughter. My quartermaster. Eh, nobody that really cares. Or nobody that I really care about. Siege is going okay over here. This is more the one that I need to keep an eye on. What was that? liberate the guy of my vassal from the other vassal okay whatever guys <laughs> you do whatever the hell you want okay we still have we have righteous imprisonment on this guy wait isn't this the guy that's over here it is well then looks like we're gonna be doing the same thing to you then 
So imprison your butt. Oh no, he's raised his flag in rebellion. Whatever am I gonna do? I'm so scared. I am kind of scared of that though, so we need to hurry the siege up so we can go back down and take over those two dudes. Looks like they're all merging like up here-ish, which is fine. It gives me more time. 35 ducats, hells yeah. Demand important prisoners. Sure. We got some prisoners. I like prisoners. Well, you're white-haired, are you? No, you're not a Targaryen. What am I talking about? There's all the white-haired people are out here. Because they're all Valerians. Anyways, uh, ransom. All them peeps. Should get some good money out of that. Oh, hells no, you are not going to be arbitrary. That's just silly. Okay. It's a little bit of money there. And we shall go. Whoops. I guess my kingdom's over here. And drop these guys off here so they can help out. Everyone with the shyness. Stop being shy. Ah, oh, too bad he didn't pick up Agarius. It's alright. He's turning out okay ish. He's. I don't know. For 80 years old, he's fine. I wish he had more diplomacy. More rounded out diplomacy would be good, but he doesn't, so. That Gregarious would have helped. Gregarious is like, what, plus two, plus three? Plus two. And then a bunch of other really good things, too. Like opinion boosts and all that. Nice. 100 ducats, 80 prestige. Works for me. We can lower you. And then we'll send these guys over here. We'll finish these two off, and then we can revoke their titles, and we will have some actual pirates out here. And then I'll have to kick out my best friend at some point, but that's fine. I did not like him anyways. I did not want to be his friend. He wanted to be mine. Screw his friendship. I just want his territory. And, um, well, I guess you guys have to not be looters. More important prisoners. Yay! Ransom all. Take this guy over now. <clears throat> Excellent. We have... You know what? I'm just gonna rush it. We got enough troops here that I don't really care. And none of them are my troops, so it's fine. Let's wait for one tick, just... Just to give them, give us a little bit of a morale boost, since they are the numbers are fairly even. And we'll do the last siege as well. A son was born. Oh, got excited there for a second. I hoped he'd be a strong son, but he's not. He is a useless son, just like the rest of them. All right, so we got all these things done. Demand all the prisoners again. Ransom all the prisoners again. And after this money comes through, we will end the wars. Oh, look at that. We're rich. Alright, cool. So the only people in prison are the two counts. Time to end your war. You're already in prison, so you're not going anywhere. And same with you. And now... Really? We can't exile him? Well, whatever. He's still a traitor, so... Both of you are traitors. Both of you are nothing. And both of you have claims that... I could... Hmm... I'm just thinking about... Executing him. That's not gonna. Yeah, it's not gonna be worth it. The Lords of Principality of Wallano. What does that even mean? Oh, because he's in. Is he part of somebody else's court now? So he's gonna piss off. Or I'm gonna piss off these guys if I kill them. I don't really care about pissing them off, to be honest. And I don't want their claims around. 
But I do like their money, so I'm just gonna go for that. I guess he's only got the ten. Oh no, he's only, never never mind. I was gonna say he's only got ten ducats. No, he's got more than that. He's just he can only respond to one at a time. And uh, let me just check my phone real quick because I have a feeling things gone off. Yes, it has. So we are going to leave off the episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed as always. We are we're doing okay. I mean, no real progress made here, but actually no, we I, you could say this is progress. We kicked these guys out so we can take it over and you know turn it into proper pirate territory. Still waiting on this claim. Got a few uh, few raids done, which was nice. I mean, we do have a ton of money, which uh, oh, I'm actually going to force my kids to train too. <laughs> Well, I'm super happy that I forced him to train, so that kid is not going to be my heir anymore, that's for damn sure. Oh, it's too bad he was diligent, too. Crap, man. Well, let's force the other one to train. It's fine. I just... Oh, man. What is the chance that you'd become maimed? Oh, I guess you don't know. Okay, so he became Roth. That's, that's fine, I suppose. So, you are not going to be the heir anymore, son of mine. Not if you're maimed. I mean, we'll see. We'll see how you turn out. You might still be okay, but... At this point, I'm way more tempted to give to this guy who's got... Who's a skilled fighter, he's just zealous. And Roth, who's got all the crazy martial. He's only really suffering from a stutter, which is minus one diplomacy. Which is really not a big deal. Because it would have been the same penalty here. Yep, it looks like uh, Kuhuro is going to be the new heir once he comes of age. Because I don't think we can do anything until then. I don't, I don't think we can give him the title. I'm just curious. No, dude. Stop. I got it. I got it handled. Just, I'm dealing with something right now. And uh, I guess we might as well do this guy now. And can I... Nope, still can't uh, force this guy out, which is all sorts of lame. Can rescue a bunch of people from captivity. Don't really care. Just want to see if the personal interaction gives me an option. I doubt it, though. Yeah, no, I can't do anything to him. So yeah, I'm going to leave off the episode here. Hope you guys are enjoying the series as always. If you are, you know what to do with them. Like, send them comments. And I will catch you next time. Take care.